E and F are the points on the sides PQ and PR respectively of a triangle PQR. For each of the following cases, state whether EF is parallel to QR. Now let us check if EF parallel to QR in the first problem. So now let us have the figure with the required data, given data. Now we have to check if EF is parallel to QR. For that we have to remember converse of basic proportionality theorem. What is it? If a line divides any two sides of a triangle in the same ratio, then the line is parallel to the third side. EF is the line. It divides PQ and PR. If it divides in the same ratio, means PE by EQ is equal to PF by FR, then the line EF is parallel to QR. So now let us find LHS. What is LHS here? 3.9 means PE is equal to 3.9. EQ is equal to 3. No need to remove the decimal place. It is very easy problem. 1.3. Now let us check RHS. PF by FR. What is PF? 3.6. FR how much? 2.4. Here also, no need to remove the decimal places. Here, 12 threes are 12 twos are. That is equal to 1.5. So, LHS is not equal to RHS. This is RHS. So, EF is not parallel to QR. Now let us check EF is parallel to QR in the second problem. So now let us have the figure. How to check EF is parallel to QR? Just remember the converse of basic proportionality theorem. What does it state? If a line divides any two sides of a triangle in the same ratio, then the line is parallel to the third side. Same as the previous. So now let us check uh, LHS. What is LHS? PE by EQ. What is it? 4 by 4 by 4.5. If you want, uh, you can remove the decimal place. It may be difficult for you. 40 by 45. 5 8s are 5 9s are. 8 by 9. Okay. No need to simplify it further. Then what is RHS? 8 by 9. Okay. Here is also 8 by... LHS is also 8 by 9. RHS is also 8 by 9. So, EF is parallel to QR. Now, let us check the third problem. Now, let us have the figure. Here, PQ is 1.2, full length. Little bit difficult, 1.28. PR is 2.56. PE is 0 0.18. PF is 0 0.36. Here's uh, we have to prove EF is uh, parallel to QR. We can use uh, converse of basic proportionality theorem here. 
as it states if a line uh, divides any two sides of a triangle in the same ratio then the line is parallel to the third side or you can use uh, corollary of bpt also but uh, it may be difficult for you i think no no you can i'll show you just how how to see it is not a converse of basic proportionality here i am directly doing the problem p e by p q what is it 0.18 divided by 1.28 this becomes 18 by 128 what is it 29s are 264s are i think uh, it won't uh, get further simplified so leave it like that only okay here let us check p f by p r what is it 0.36 upon 2.56 so 36 by 256 four nines are 36 four six are 24 carry one 16 so so pe by pq is equal to pf by fr so the line is parallel this line is parallel to qr but uh, i think uh, it may be little bit difficult for you so now let us check pe by eq is equal to pf by fr how uh, so we have to find eq here 1.28 minus 0.18 what is it 1.1 here 2.56 minus 0.36 what is it 2.2 now let us check pe by eq what is it 0.18 divided by 1.1 okay let us put 110 what is it 29s are 25s are 10 25s are let it be then let us check uh, left hand side what is it 0.36 by 2.20 36 by 220 49s are 4 Five zar twenty, four five zar twenty. Here you can observe that LHS is equal to RHS, so EF is parallel to QR. 